When I was just a young child, I was scared of going to high school. I thought that the amount of work would be unbearable and that I would be left behind on the other kids. In the dust. They seemed to complete all of the tests and assignments so quickly and so easily. I would always be the last one struggling with book work and would take a very long time to finish easy homework assignments. My ha ha moment came in eighth grade in the history class of Miss Pierce. I had little drive or motivation in school because I was not interested in any of the subjects. However, I was fascinated by the history of the greatest nation in the world and more eager to learn than any other student in the class. My ha ha moment was that if I had a positive attitude about learning, I could focus very well and excel past my peers. I was skeptical that I could continue to be successful in high school history. However, the material in Ms. Nelson's class grabbed my attention immediately. Learning that class felt effortless, and the information would flow into my brain and stick. However, I still lacked the interest and motivation in my other classes. That is until I discovered the fascinating class of English with Ms. Cabot. The skills I learned from two years of Galileo English allowed me to create an essay that I was extremely proud of, as it showed my development as a writer. This essay was a piece of work that could not have been created without the skills Ms. Cannon taught me. However, it was not just writing skill that allowed me to succeed, but rather a positive attitude and spirit that was embedded into me by my fellow group members. Working groups transformed not only the way I approached schoolwork, but also the way I approached life. Instead of viewing other people's distractions, I viewed them as important assets to my end goals. With the help of a group, I could easily receive peer feedback and motivation, creating a more advanced final product than ever before. I think that project-based learning is truly the best way to learn for this reason, as it teaches not only skills, but work habits and life ideals. Uh, once nearing the end of a product, project, I feared that my other group members would not pull their weight to produce a high quality product. Instead of being angry or just doing the entire thing myself, as I would have before in Galileo, I used the communication skills I had learned to help them focus and contribute. What resulted was a Best Cinematography Winning Documentary, as shown at the film festival this December. Overall, I'm extremely lucky that I was able to be a part of such a, of, of a small learning community and such a great education program. Now I have all that I need to be successful in a modern society. Using the tools I have acquired, I can excel in many fields for the rest of my life, as well as provide for those that I care about. In terms of my life after education, I can bring the skills I need with me to advance to jobs. In the end, having a positive attitude and keeping an open mind means more than anything. And I hope others can learn the valuable things I have learned on their path through life.